Today we're going to make some simple knots. They're overhand knots. We're going to make a basic overhand knot, a slipped overhand knot, and a double overhand knot. Overhand knots are one of the simplest of all knots and they're used quite a bit for just about any activity because they form a very tight knot that can't easily be taken apart. So it's a very secure knot. Just using a piece of rope, that's all you need. We're going to start with the basic overhand knot. So we've got two ends of the rope. One is the working end, which is the shorter end, and the other, which is the rest of it, is just the long end. So what we're going to do is we're going to hold the long end in my left hand. We're going to take the working end in my right hand. I'm going to turn it like this. So basically the working end is going underneath the long end. This is just for the basic overhand knot, and we're going to slip that through and pull it tight. And that gives you your basic overhand knot. I'll do that one more time. Have the working end in your right hand and the rest of the rope in your left hand. Make a loop with the working end being underneath the longer end and put the working end through the top of the hole and pull it tight. And that's your basic overhand knot. Now we're going to make a slipped overhand knot. A slipped overhand knot is good for a lot of things because it gives you a loop that you can attach to something to make a real strong connection and I'll show you that in just a second. So a slipped overhand knot is made pretty much the same way as a basic overhand knot. You're going to basically make your turn like you did before and you're going to take this instead of putting it through like that we're going to put it through as a loop. So you're going through like this and we're going to pull that up to tighten it here and now what we did is we built a sort of a slip knot type of overhand knot. So what you can do here is you can put this in and pull it tight. So it makes a good knot to hold on to things. It's often used to attach to pilings or whatever you need to attach a rope to in a very quick manner. Again, to do that knot, just flip it over just like you do in the basic overhand knot. Push a loop through and pull it tight. And that's it. It slides up and down. And of course, once you're done with it, it comes apart very easily until you put something into it and then it holds on tightly. The third one is a double overhand knot. And again, it's very simple to do. You build it just like a regular overhand knot. So you've got your rope, you make your initial loop, and you go through two times one and then two and then you carefully pull it tight. And that's your double over here knot. It's pretty knot. It sort of looks like a figure eight here if you stretch it out a bit. And this is just a little bit of a larger knot than the single over here knot. It's still very secure and very good for when you need something a little bit larger. You can also crunch it together and get something like this here. Sorry about that little blur there. My camera adjusted. Uh, and that's it for your basic overhand knot tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you on another one.